hello YouTube this is Chris Kerbal Space Program Career Mode point two two update this is actually um, a side career that I had started prior to doing my little series here but this is uh, something that was part of another career and I ended up being making this uh, rover and landing it on Minmus after some considerable difficulties but I ended up getting this on the on the surface but I found out it was just the gravity was so minimal here and this rover was so light that it was nearly impossible to control so I will just uh, let my awful driving skills and light low gravity microgravity uh, do the talking here and uh, I ended up landing in the nighttime so I waited until morning to actually start moving around because I, I wanted to see where I was flying to. Basically that's what happens. This thing is just completely all over the place due to the microgravity. I, I should have had RCS uh, on top that was being able to push me down to keep me on the ground but this didn't have any RCS on it at all. It, just it was just a, a basic rover that I made and uh, I was just testing it out. I had uh, just figured I'd try it out here instead of the moon or Duna. Basically, this is just uh, me driving around, messing around. Uh, as you're going down the hill, if you try to apply even brakes lightly, you'll flip forward. So I tried putting, uh, at times I tried just putting, when I was going downhill, I made the rear wheels the active only and uh, tried to you know use them to slow me down. And, and you can see it right there. Um, uh, they're not, it's not slowing me down. And then... Uh, just uh, massive spaz out flips turns uh yeah it broke something i don't know what exploded but uh i didn't see anything critical so i don't i'm not sure what what exploded uh, the thing's still on minus it's still it's actually upright for some miraculous way it stayed uh, on its wheels it's a little top heavy so i was kind of surprised and and every time i flipped over i was just cringing that it, uh, would get stuck there there was no uh, reaction wheels or extra controls. It was just just the uh, the probe body that's just underneath that adapter, and then the probe itself, uh, the uh, the frame itself, just some some of those deck plates, and a couple other things. It's it, you know it's a light rover. It was really really light, so it was easy to launch. But it just Minmus is just so so small. It just doesn't have enough gravitational pull and you end up with something like this. Uh, again, it's my inexperience. I've never been to Minmus with a vehicle, and uh, that was... It was interesting. And on the moon, it would still probably bounce up a little bit, but definitely not like this. It would, you know, remain in contact. I guess my... If I was to fix this or, or do it again, I'd put um, RCS on it, and even just the mass from the fuel would help weigh it down a little bit. But uh, the RCS, I could use it to, to keep myself planted on the surface. Uh, and if for some reason it flipped out and it landed on its top, uh, you'd need the RCS to be able to turn it over. Because I, I, even with the, the microgravity here, the reaction wheels in the probe body were not enough to, to turn it over. I, if it was already moving, I could try to keep it, you know, try to keep turning it until it landed on its wheels. But if it was at a standstill on its on its top then it would not uh, it would not be able to flip back over on the right side as you can see I, I got control to the rear wheels and uh, I'm, I'm just t tapping the accelerator here and it's just lifting the front up so I mean there's plenty of torque on these wheels enough to make it do wheelies even at uh, a speed uh, I don't know how fast I'm going here but you know just again if you're gonna go to E, uh, Minmus with with a rover. Make sure it's either a heavy enough to not do that, or b have some kind of control system to keep it from doing that. And or if it does, you can at least try to bring it under control without breaking too many parts or flipping all the way down around the hill. But that was my Minmus rover shenanigans.
And uh, if you like it, just comment, subscribe, and let me know what you want to see.